Hi there, this is Al from TheGamingGeek.net and today we've got another PlayStation 2 game request. We're playing it on the Redbird Pocket 3 Plus and it is Def Jam Fight for New York or Fight for NY and uh, we're so it's loading right now but um, I think this game is one that needs the sleep mode trick so if you don't know what the sleep mode trick is all you have to do is uh, when you turn your your retroid pocket 3 plus on you have to put it in sleep mode for 20 to 30 seconds i don't think uh it going on sleep mode because you left it idle works you have to manually trigger the sleep mode um so we, i haven't done the sleep mode trick so i've been seeing some reds here in the upper right but let's take a look see how it performs All right, so just just so you know that uh, I'm not faking it, I'm going to take a look at the settings that I have currently. So under system, we have cycle rate at 100%, cycle skip at mild underclock, graphics, we have Vulkan as our GPU renderer, everything else is basically default. You have hardware download mode at accurate, threaded presentation enabled, uh, I think, yeah. All default, even uh, anywhere else, it's default, multi-threaded VU1, uh, check, so. There, it's obviously slow, right? So if you want the cutscenes running nicely, you have to put it in sleep mode. I think the game itself uh, plays okay if you don't do the sleep mode trick. There you go, super slow. So we're gonna skip that and actually we're not gonna proceed. I'm going to do the sleep mode. We're not gonna capture it anymore. And then we're gonna take a look at the intro again. All right, we're back. And what's good about the sleep mode trick is that um, when you've done it already, uh, it lasts. Uh, you can play different games and you don't have to do sleep mode again and again. Uh, and uh, earlier, um, all I did was just put it in sleep mode. I didn't have to uh, restart the device. And look at what happens. Now, I did turn the volume down a bit because I don't want to get any copyright strikes. You think... The intro is playing some copyrighted uh, music given who the people are uh, in this game, right? Alright, so that one was still slow. But look at this. You know what? I'll just turn up the volume. So you do get a bit of reds, but it's not a consistent red unlike earlier, right? Now the animation is uh, playing at the right speed. By the way, we're playing the PAL version of this game. So I'm going to turn the volume down now, uh, but we're going to continue watching the um, cutscene because it's pretty interesting. Let me just adjust the freaking lighting. All right, I think this is much better. It's so funny to see uh, real life people like Ludacris and uh, I don't recognize all of them. So I'm not a big uh, hip hop fan. There you go. All right, it's almost like a UFC style thing. So we do get some reds in the opening sequence. I think that's not what's important. So we're going to skip and uh, we're going to start our game. Alright, so I will tell you I've already disabled the, the music from the beatbox. So we're going to go into a single player story. And we're going to create a new 
character so that we can go through the motions of creating your character right and let's see if uh, there's going to be any um, performance issues save test we'll save test um by the way this is another uh, game that uh has a learning curve to it and I don't have the time to really learn the mechanics so my apologies Def Jam veterans um, I'm gonna be terrible at this game as per usual all right man I'm gonna have to turn the volume down so you can see the at least we, we can watch the what's hap we can watch the cutscene right or the opening movie all right oops hit his head uh just for entering the car so there you go that's not our character i thought that was our character but So we do see some reds occasionally, but I think uh, they're so quick that reds in the uh, performance. So um, yeah. All right, so we're gonna create our own uh, character because. We want to test how how it plays, right? So uh, I want someone a little on the slim side. And maybe, you know, 6 is a good height. Yeah, uh, medium's okay. Hmm. Just so it will stand out, because there's a lot of um, uh, African Americans in the cast. We're gonna choose someone a little bit um, on the lighter, uh, someone Caucasian, right? Maybe someone a little tan. Actually, when I was making my uh, hmm big chin, just choose this. You know what, I mean, don't have to really take long. Hmm, I'll just choose this one. No facial hair and a little brown uh, for the hair color. Yes, that's him. We'll choose clean cut. All right. So.
To be on. To be honest, I was going for a John Cena type uh, look for the for my character. And I think I pulled it off. I mean, he's not an exact look-alike of John Cena, but he does give you that vibe, doesn't he? All right. So here, um, there are multiple. Um, I'll pick Street Fighter because I'm not used to the game's mechanics, and it also fits my knowledge, right? I mean, this is just undisciplined fighters relying on punching, right? Uh, so I'll go with Street Fighter. Now, if we get any bad performance dips, I'm going to adjust the settings. But so far, it's running fast, right? And this is the PAL version again. Press X to grab opponent, move L and press O. That's not much of a pro. Alright, so blocking is R1, move. Alright, so the training opponent wasn't really giving me much uh, resistance. But when I was practicing uh, this wish test, do you wish to save test? So save test. Uh, are you sure I want to override test? Yeah. The, um, the computer AI was, well the AI was giving me a really tough time, even in the easiest difficulty. Uh, you know what, Let's just keep saving. Yeah, come on. Alright, so that went smoothly, right? There are some performances here and there. But I think what's important is in the actual match. And in the actual match, uh, it played well. Doesn't sound like John Cena though. All right. Okay, so let's see how these function. Blah blah blah. I can teach you new moves, new styles. Come down to Stapleton when you're ready to sweat, and then here's. Okay, well that's my voicemail. It's funny the how the mobile phone looks. Look at that. I haven't seen this kind of phone in, in quite a while. All right, where am I supposed to? Am I supposed to go to wardrobe, clothing? I don't think I have lots of uh, options. Oh, we can't. All right, well, don't have options, so I guess we just have to go to the map. Shop district. All right, we're supposed to go here. 
syndicates, athletics, barber shop. I don't like tattoos. Inspired creations from the king of bling. Oh, okay. Shop for clothes. Learn new styles. So we're going to do shop for clothes. Oh, we'll buy a jersey. one yeah buy this jersey and then shoes let's do athletic we want some pumps or something it looks like basketball shoes and then I want some shorts but want cargo shorts oh no I don't want this you know what I'll keep the, the pants Then maybe, do we have a reverse camo? Right I'll just do the low front backwards. Alright, buy this headwear. Alright, we saved some money there. I think that didn't cost us a lot. Um, should we go to Stapleson? Upgrade your skills. Train skills. Um. Oh, I can, I have lots of points. So let's be average. And then total cost increase. And then let's be a little bit fast. Except these changes. Alright, so we've shopped for clothes. We've done our... What did he say? Hit the clubs. Uh, I don't know where, where else he wants me to go. I don't want to get tattoos. Maybe we should just visit each of the... So we'll just visit each of the shops and then we'll just, I don't know if we, we need to do that to trigger the next scene. Alright, so we've been to all of the shops. The foundation, alright, now let's go here. Trick, street fighting, alright, looks like street fighting is the uh, more common uh, fighting style at the start. Alright, we're going to do test versus trick, 
I think I chose the right name because it test fits right in with how these characters are named. All right, I'm still not used to how to. I'm still not used to how to finish uh... Oh man It sounds so simple, right? But uh, the action is so fast. It's almost like a wrestling pit fighting game. Ooh, I'm in danger. Ugh. Yeah, we'll do a rematch. The controls are simple, it's just, you know, the timing and like how to get through blocks and things like that that I'm not used to. Even just uh, KOing, uh, yeah, this one for example. I don't know why after I made the grapple, how he was able to like... Yeah, those things, uh, I don't know what's going on. Oh man. It's also a little dark, but there's no way to change the... Lighting effects. Oh man. Here we go again. I'm gonna get KO'd again. Alright. All right, I'm going to choose no, and I don't think I am going to progress in story mode any further than, than this. Uh, so we're just going to play through some of the other modes, right? We're going to exit. All right. I, wa I want to go far but really i don't have the time to to learn to don't have the time to invest in this game so let's just see um so let's see how it looks like when it's a team match standard rules uh why am i choosing a memory card no continue All right, I'll be using someone who's good at the street fighting. So I guess nine, and I will choose someone. 
I'll choose Buster Rhymes as my teammate, and then we'll do, we'll fight against. Uh, we'll fight against Method Man and Red Man. All right. Let's see how it plays with um, four characters. Oh crud! I thought it was like this. I thought that was a loading screen. Sorry. It was just waiting for me to choose a location. All right, Buster Rhymes. Let me just check the lighting. I hope it's not too bright. Oh no. All right, we killed one. And that was actually a fair KO, right? It's not like I was being helped by Buster Rhymes. All right, and it's moving pretty, pretty well, even though there's four uh, characters. One of them's knocked out. All right, Buster Rhymes is gonna go for the kill. Yeah, finish him, man. Woo. Now that's a special move. I'm a little silent because I'm trying to figure out how to end this match. No. Oh. All right, uh, Buster Rhymes. I think I also did well there. Anyhow, you now have 10 points. I'm not gonna save, rematch, no. So what else do we have? Um, One on one team match, free for all. Let's. I think team match is just two on two, right? Take the pain, multiply it times two. So free for all, every man for himself. No holds barred. I don't know why it keeps asking me for the memory card, but. Uh, let's go for it. Uh, nope, I'm not gonna. Uh, 
select number of fighters. Let's go for four. And exhibit is here. He has kickboxing. You know what? I'll choose exhibit. And then we'll have an all star uh, match. So, Method Man, Red Man, and then Buster Rhymes. All right. Oh, crud. Chose the same uh, arena. So, I'm a kickboxer. And sorry, I had to turn the music off. I'm pretty sure if I didn't do that, uh, I would get a copyright strike. I actually wanted to play as uh, Busta Rhymes. It's actually uh, running pretty fast. I can't keep up. All right, that's the way to win is to keep out of everyone's way oh man wonder how he can counter here all right Almost like sweet chin music here. I'll just let them fight. <laughs> Until I can sneak in with this. Nope. Hey man, I mean, you know, I can't even hit them. Oops. Who's got a weapon? Anyone have weapons? Oh! Can't even see my character, my goodness. Oh, I'm winning. I thought I was the one. Yeah, I can't figure out how to knock characters out. It's so easy for him to grapple me.
All right, I'm on fire again. On fire. Ah. Oh, wow. I don't know what's going on. I don't know how to finish this guy. There, there's a broom. All right. Go for the sweep. Oh no. All right, I won by mashing buttons. Wait, I I don't know what happened there. There you go. Uh, learn fifteen, earn fifteen points. Not saving. Um, no, no rematch. All right, so we're gonna back out of that and then we're just going to take a look at the other options so we've done free for all team and one on one unlock rewards extras beatbox options high scores credits uh what's in extras cheats fight intro fight uh death yeah uh, yeah unlock rewards unlock fighters got baby chris wait where am i Red man. Oh, okay. Cost 25 points. Oh, they're all uh, hidden. Bless. Kickboxing. Alright. Let's unlock Bless. I thought he was uh, kickboxing. Alright. No, not saving. All right, so we'll just do one more. We'll do one on one because we haven't done one on one, and we'll do no submissions, so that it's gonna be you know uh, my advantage. Not use the using a user ID. Continue, and I'm gonna choose our new unlock character, Bless. And, you know, I like Busta Rhymes. I mean, out of all these people, he's the one I really know. We'll choose... What are their venues? Stapleton Athletics. We'll do the power plant. Alright. Well, bless you, Busta Rhymes. Right, we're just gonna have one more match and we'll wrap it up but I would say that even though the the metrics here at the upper right have some reds it actually plays pretty well right oh by the way I don't know how this plays for real so if this is like on fast forward or uh, if it's slow I don't know I can't tell it is a little fast for me. Sometimes I have trouble reacting to what's happening on the screen. I don't know how to counter. Oh, 
Uh, grapples, that's for sure. Oh, right. No submissions here, so sorry. We've got the advantage. Ooh, nice. We keep getting, like, grappled. How do I counter grapple? Can't attack uh, an opponent when he's down? Yep, when you don't know the game, you have to be cheesy. like he's so good at countering my moves and I, I'm so helpless once he has me on a grapple you can't even pick up a weapon I know it said it said triangle or uh, square in the tutorial In there, I tried for a grapple, but... Oh no. We're both in danger. Oh <laughs> He hit me with an umbrella. Okay, well that was a good enough match and I think we've seen enough of this game to say that it's gonna run well uh, with the settings that I'm using. So we'll take a look at that. Oops. Um, just to recap the settings I'm using. Uh, very minimal changes to optimal defaults. I just have system settings at mild underclock. Didn't change anything really, uh, but you do have to perform the sleep mode trick. Uh, so I'll do a rematch as I close this. But yeah, um, Def Jam Fight for NY or Fight for New York. Uh, good performance under Retro Pocket 3 Plus, right? Looks good here, even though uh, it's just uh, one X resolution. Oops. Oh, wow. That's a nice move. Okay. To the person who requested this game, I hope you like what you see. Uh, let me just... I hope you like what you are seeing right now. And uh, everyone else, I hope you enjoyed this game request. Uh, if you have any other uh, games you want to see, played on the Retro Pocket 3 Plus or any of other, the other devices that I own. Let me know and I'll add it to the list. Once again, this is Al from GamingGeek.net. Talk to you in the next video.